Now, for many of us, as we go through the month of April, we'll continue to see the increasing number of showers as we go through the rest of this week. But right now, it's mostly fair. Just occasional showers are likely. Mostly first thing in the morning as you go through the hillsides around Tobago. The usual suspected areas are Roxburgh down towards the Mason Hall into Plymouth, etc. And then through the afternoon, the sunshine will come out quite briskly as we go towards the Castara and the Paltuvia. There's a possibility of some breeze coming through there. Out towards Blanchichers, uh, Valencia and Arima, a light shower is expected the first thing this morning. There's a low to medium chance of that uh, light to moderate shower as you go through the day, but more so for the first part of your day. So through Arima and into Valencia, it should brighten up once you get past lunchtime. For San Fernando and the Pinal as well, the possibility of a few showers coming by as you go through the day. Most of the showers, again, will be on the light to moderate side, but there will be lots of sunshine around. So what that means is that by today we'll likely see temperatures as high as 32 degrees Celsius in Trinidad, 31 likely in Tobago. It will feel comfortable for the most part, all courtesy of the breeze around. Now through Wednesday we'll still see maybe just a brief shower or two. And then on Thursday it brightens up quite nicely. And then on Friday we return to some brisk showers coming through to end the working week, especially along eastern areas of Trinidad. Heading offshore, we continue to see those uh, east-southeasterly winds of 15 knots. A few white caps are likely, but the offshore waves have dropped significantly. We're only looking at highs of 2 meters out in the Atlantic, maybe 1.5 meters to the Caribbean, and the short northeasterly swells will remain at 9 seconds. And you have your high tide at 6:15 a.m. and high tide again at 7 p.m. So that's your weather, and that's it from me.